It's championship week in Mountain West golf. The women will tee off their championship tournament at Mission Hills Country Club in Rancho Mirage, California, starting on Thursday, April 24th. We are pleased to be joined by the head coach of the defending champion, Rebels of UNLV, Amy Bush. Coach, you win your first championship last year. You get to take that celebratory plunge into the lake, greenside at Mission Hills. How often do you think about that moment? It had to be a tremendous moment for you and your girls. Well, it was for sure. I mean, we it, it's pretty much every day for me because uh, we got such great pictures of it um, from us taking the plunge in that I, I have them in my office right next to the trophy to remind me every day about the hard work and, and dedication that it takes to get to that point and win a Mountain West Conference championship. Uh, it's a big deal for these student athletes and uh, they've been talking about it all year. They want to take that jump again. You got many of the same girls on your team this year as you had last year. They came back from eight strokes down to win the championship last year. How much pressures are on them as the defending champions heading into this week? You know, you know, we have a ton of it, um, but but we're you know we've been playing so well this spring that the student athletes are ready for it, and we're trying to put them in different pressure positions on you know playing competitions during practice and and, and really putting them in tough tough positions when they get. Um, on the golf course at practice to get used to it and get used to being in that pressure cooker. Um, hopefully by now again we're, we're going to be bringing four of the same student athletes with us um, that played last year so so they know what it's like and I think uh, once you get past that first one the second one's uh, I'm hoping a little bit easier for us. One of those returning players Dana Finkelstein the reigning Mountain West player of the year ranked 16th in the nation right now by Golf Week. What do you expect from her? Because I would imagine she's the odds on favorite to win the individual title. That's a lot of pressure. What do you expect from her? You know, she's, we're used to the heat. So it's going to be hot down there. And I, I know she's going to have a great week. And her and I have been talking a lot about, about how to prepare and make sure that you know, we have the right mindset and that we're being healthy and doing the things of getting good sleep and making sure we're keeping up in school. So that way she doesn't have any outside pressures. It's just the pressures between her and the golf course. You know, we've got, she's got some tough competition with Sammy Stevens from New Mexico and Serene Blair and Emma from San Diego State. Um, and, and of course, you know, don't forget Reagan from uh, our new conference with uh, San Jose State. Um, I, I mean, I think it's going to be a great week of golf down there, and I'm really excited to see who comes out as the individual champion and also the team champion. Certainly will be a great field. What are some of the challenges that the Dinah Shore Championship course presents for these ladies? Where are the challenges, maybe a couple of holes, and where could this tournament ultimately be won? Well, I think it's going to come down to 18 again. I mean, 18 being a tough par 5, I mean, you've got to make sure you get your drive right, and then you have to put yourself in the right position to be able to hit that uh, approach shot to that green because, you know, as we know last year, I mean, I remember watching Demi Mack, she hit it over the green in a playoff hole um, to, to, to lose the playoff hole. Um, so it's, it's all about uh, a placement on this golf course. The golf course is going to be an unbelievable condition again with the fact that the Kraft Nabisco was hosted there just a few weeks ago. Um, but I think that weather permitting, I think it's going to be hot. Um, it's always going to be windy. It's Palm Springs. Um, so, you know, we, we've got some weather factors that are going to come into play too. And, and I, I think that the best team that can handle those situations are, are ultimately going to be the winners. Coach, appreciate your time and good luck in your uh, defense of your title this week. Thanks. We look forward to seeing you guys. Mountain West Championship tees off in Rancho Mirage, California on Thursday. The Mountain West Network will have your coverage after each round. From the Mountain West Network studio, I'm Jesse Kurtz.